March 7th, 22 years ago, a queen was born. Since this video might be all over the place, I thought I'll just explain of what I did. So I wanted to do an at-home birthday photo shoot. I wanted to get my nails done. Me and my twin sister went to the SEC Basketball Women's Championship game. Go to dinner, brunch, whatever. I guess this is like my little birthday week. When it's my birthday, I just try to keep it very chill. Pisces season, I'm a Pisces, but I do love my birthdays because it's a celebration about me. I honestly didn't know what to do for my birthday, so I just took it day by day, and this is how the outcome turned out. I thought I would take you guys along with me to celebrate my birthday. I was thinking about getting a backdrop, so it seems like a really good one. a trial run to see like how the place was set up so I can order something and see how it is before I actually order my cake. I got the confetti and this looks so good. I also got red velvet. Look how yummy that looks. I got two light that I can put my cake. This is the night before my birthday and finally all my packages have came in so I'm going to show what I got. Yesterday I went and got me these red roses. These are so pretty and this is my way of treating myself so I bought me some roses because roses are very beautiful and I just wanted to do some cute flowers. First off I just ordered some birthday candles. These are metallic gold candles. This is really cute. I got 22 gold numbers. I got two of these and these are light sparkling light so when I light them up they'll sparkle everywhere. First package I'm going to open is from Amazon so I hurried up and got like mostly the backdrop and some other balloons I think so let's open this and see what I got and whenever I was preparing for my birthday it was honestly all over the place so I know that I wanted like a gold theme this year so just going with the flow by now so I'm planning to do an at-home photo shoot this is the backdrop curtain I really wanted just a white background because I'm gonna be wearing black again this year I wore black previous years I guess black is my favorite color because I keep wearing it every year got me this happy birthday tiara this is so cute I love it oh that's so pretty Okay, look at this. This is so pretty. I can't wait to put it on and just wear it. Like, <laughs> my hair is so big. Just wear it like that. Honestly, that's kind of cute. I got this I'm Feeling 22 cake topper. If you know, you know Taylor Swift. She was like the thing when I was younger. I used to be so obsessed with Taylor Swift when I was younger. And I always sung this song acting like I was actually 22. And now that I'm here, like, this is so unreal. I'm feeling 22. Everything will be alright if 22. And lastly for Amazon, I just got the number 22 gold balloons. Now I'm going to open my Fashion Nova package. I'm excited for this one. First, I ordered the Top Trend Rupt Maxi Dress in black. Of course, I had to go black again. I really need to stop wearing so much black. But this is like mesh see-through. Like you can see that already. Look, it's just really cute. What it looks like it's kind of rutched and it goes like off the shoulder, but it's like see-through mesh. This was just an encase dress, just in case I didn't have an outfit or I didn't know what's where. I can have this on. I'm excited for this one. <laughs> Every year, I have to always do something sequin. This is a t-shirt dress that says, it's my birthday. It's my birthday. <laughs> and I got two pairs of earrings. I'm a gold and silver girly, so old thick hoops. That's kind of cute. This is my earring that I got. This is the one I just bought. I really like this one. This is so cute, and it's thick and big, and it pops. It came with three sets. So really cute. I should have planned all this out better. Today is my birthday! Yay! I'm 22. I'm about to head to my birthday bunch right now and I just finished getting ready. I just have this long black maxi dress on that has like a little slit and some silver sandals. I was gonna wear it as my birthday t-shirt dress but I'm gonna just wait and change later when I'm around my family so I can wear that. Now I'm about to head on to my little brunch with my twin sister. Happy birthday to both of us! And it's such a beautiful, cool, sunny day. I just love this time. Usually my birthday is like really cold so I'm glad like the weather is pretty good today. And I'm about to head to my little brunch! We finally made it to our destination safely and now we're about to go in there and eat. Headed to Kickback Jax. Baby girl, you are so pretty, 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 pretty. Baby girl, you are so pretty, 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 pretty. Females made you just touching me. The entire menu, they got a whole bunch of options. Wings look so good. I'm thinking about getting the pasta because I really love pasta. How did I go all the way in there and forgot my wallet? Like that makes no sense. This is what it kind of looks like. We're in the back. They put us all the way in the back. I got my little TV right here that I can watch. They got LSU playing. I really want to see the LSU game this weekend. We got the appetizers. I got the Philly cheesecake egg rolls. She said they're really good, so I got that to try it. And she got some delicious nachos. It's got meat and cheese in it. Mm. Mm. 
Mm, that is really good. So good. I was gonna order me a drink, but since I'm driving, I'm not. I'll get a drink later when I get home by champagne or something. Food arrived, and that was super quick, but look how good this looks. Oh my gosh. And I got a side of toast with it. Oh, so good. I got shrimp with this one, not chicken. so full but that was a pretty quick little brunch and it was pretty good and i don't want to get too full and i feel like i'm a little food coma now i'm tired i'm ready to go to bed <laughs> but right now i'm about to head back home and we're just gonna take it hour by hour probably take a few more pictures and then go over my grandmother's to eat for our little birthday dinner and yeah the weather is so perfect today because yesterday it was raining and i was like dang it's gonna rain on my birthday but today is perfect and the server she was so nice it's kind of empty in there too which i like and we were in all in the back and i really like getting the booths i don't like getting in the table seats in the middle so it was a chill vibe oh my gosh i feel like i look just so beautiful today my little pearly pearls and we're about to head on home really quickly i made a stop here at crumble cookies because i'm using my free birthday gift and that's the only thing i got today because i don't usually sign up for a lot of things but i signed up for crumble because i get it like every once in a while so i got me a free cookie and i'm going to try the new olivia rodrigo guts cookie because my location finally has it and i've been seeing it all over my 40 page on tiktok for like weeks it's a chilled cookie and it looks kind of cool I just went to Crumble and I got the new Olivia Rodrigo Guts Cookie. My location finally has it. This at first did not look appetizing, but it's kind of cute and different. It has like that little jelly feeling in the middle. Let me get in the middle of this and try the jelly. Mmm. It just tastes like a sugar cookie with the jelly filling in the middle of it. The jelly is really good, but it just tastes like a basic crumble cookie sugar cookie. A whole mess right now, but we're taking some pictures outside. It's my birthday t-shirt dress on now i'm gonna be wearing this for the rest of the day spending time with family and that is my birthday fit Yay. Aww, my nana is the best the next day and right now i have to hurry up and go to my nail appointment i had to make a nail appointment today at like 5 p.m and right now it's four i think today she's gonna do like a little freestyle set so we'll see what she does with that but right now i'm running a little bit late to my appointment so i have to hurry up and go and plus it's raining i just finished my nail appointment and it took two and a half hours but i'm glad that she got me in today i just got some basic french tips i did like pink colors so the nail tech she was supposed to do freestyle but i guess she didn't have enough time because they closed at seven and she went over 7 30. this is what they look like and this is two three deers it's three deers right now i'm trying to fix my nails i'm going with this pink color and acrylic top coat see that's the before and after i like the pink so much better i'm a whole lot better than what they were that's yeah, cute i just set up my backdrop or i'm tempting to set up my backdrop and this is what it looks like so far i had to improvise okay so i had to make some room in my room and i just put it on the wall i had to duct tape it i couldn't get a backdrop stand because it would get here like a week or two after so i just had to improvise and that's what it looks like i didn't end up using anything that i had gold because honestly i just went black and silver again this year by accident so i just kept it like that and maybe i can do this another time I bought some last minute tickets to go to the sec women's basketball championship i'm really excited to watch lsu and south carolina i'm just excited to see a really good game i love watching women's basketball especially this year i don't know why i just got an interest in it all of a sudden i have about a two hour drive to go to south carolina which honestly i don't mind so we're gonna head on there now all black and nike shoes is what i'm wearing I look like a basketball coach. <laughs>
Okay, South Carolina. They did really good. They did not come to play. They were playing hard the entire time. And for LSU, you can tell like they were all off today. Like, I don't know what happened, but everybody was off. But number 12, she was on fire the entire night. She did so good. But I'm just so proud of South Carolina. That coach, that was such an awesome game to go to. Even though LSU was off, I really enjoyed watching South Carolina win. Definitely deserved it because they were all killing it tonight. So I think my new favorite team is South Carolina. That win was well deserved. So I don't feel like I wasted my ticket or anything. It was such a fun game to go to. So many people, that was a really good game. Dang, I really wish I got a chance to meet all the players. I really wanted to meet Angel Reese, Waje. I just really wanted to meet them, but it's all right. Yeah, the drive to South Carolina was two hours from where I live. So I was like, I'm not driving two hours back tonight. We booked a hotel to stay for the night. And that way we can just relax and enjoy the city. Staying at the sleep in, something quick and cheap. Personally, I was cheering for both teams. I wasn't rooting for this team or that team. I knew that LSU and South Carolina were really good, so I was cheering for both. This is a cute little hotel. Bathroom, a little shower. It's just for one night. The cute little bed. The little TV. And then this is our view. <laughs> Put on Medea. I love Medea movies. This is a vibe. I love Medea. <laughs> Just gone out to explore and look at the downtown area. Ooh. Got some steak and shake, and that is the end of my night.